Hello, and welcome back to the Let's Play for Dead Rising. The Dummy Edition. Yeah, not really. Now, where did I leave off last time? Uh... I think I was in the bathroom. Oh, yeah. The image in the monitor. So, how are you guys today? Yeah. I really can't hear you. You gotta speak up. Hey! I wasn't talking to you, zombies. And... Yeah. Now it's t in this section, we are pretty much starting day two. And with day two, we're going to get our second case file. Ah, uh, dang. Just, just a bit later than I really wanted to be. We're gonna get a cutscene. Before this whole thing started, someone called the professor and told him to come to this mall. Jack the line, did you? So was this the caller, this guy here? They've got something to do with the zombies, don't they? They're the reason we came here. And if he gets away with Dr. Barnaby, none of our questions will be answered. Alright, case file two, engaged, and let, yeah, let's save there. Seeing as though it's an autosave and it, it's not going to let you not save there. I'll take the extra coffee just in case. I'm gonna need that. <laughs> Quick step. <sighs> ah, dang. It was made by mixing two coffees together, so it would make you that hyper. Oh crap. Frank, looks like the shutter leading to the entrance plaza is open now. You need that guy dragging the old man open around open it. At any rate, you can get into the entrance plaza through the Paradise Plaza now. Sweet! Oh crap, I just hurt myself. Oh well. Run, run. La la la. Face crusher. I'm gonna have to demonstrate that sometime. But not right now, because day two is a very busy day, and, uh... It's kind of hard for me to get the perfect run going through on day two in one shot. tell with all the gunshots. Bacha mama. I could tell you what that means. But not gonna 
because you'll find it's out the in the game later. Look out! Dang. If we don't do something, the professor's gonna end up zombie chow. I'm going for it. You just worry about staying alive. Got it? Yeah, I think I got it. So, completely get in front of his bullets and help you out. Okay, I'll do that. Dang, the quick step ran out. Well, uh, this guy's pretty easy, but the first time you fight him, it's like, he's like really hard to beat. For the second time. Let's just take this hockey stick now. Uh, as a matter of fact, let's, uh, let's take two. And no, Brad definitely cannot take him by himself. Yeah, that's why he's difficult. He takes away that much health in one shot. But anyway, just get behind this pole, and, uh, stop running away. It... Yep, and this is basically all you gotta do. Just sh randomly shoot hockey pucks at him, and it actually works. Although I could run up to him and shoot him with a shotgun, but... I think this way is much funnier. <laughs> you, you chuck hockey pucks at him to death. Dang, I only got one more left. That's that's the great decision of having two. And how much? Yep, defeated. And it was actually on this boss I uh I encountered the Dead Rising glitch. Probably the most common one ever. He's unconscious, but alive. Ah, damn! Are you all right? Yeah, but I'm not in any condition to carry him. Can you get him back to the security room? And luckily, you really don't have to play in that part where they carry him to the security room. Oh my god! The sedative's taken effect. The professor won't be waking up anytime soon. I managed to stop the bleeding, but he's running a fever. He needs medicine. A fever? Medicine, huh? All right. Uh, I'm getting my cat right now. All right. Now it's time for the last part of uh, case two, which is the medicine run, which we're supposed to run to the pharmacy and go get medicine for Brad because he's running a fever from the gunshot for some reason. And, uh, what else is there that I should mention? Uh, hmm. No, I guess that's it. Oh, wait, yeah, there is one more thing I should mention. Uh, okay, apparently now they decide not to, uh, give you any more respawn things in the security room, but while you're here, take a picture of this. Fantastic. There we go. That is perfect. That's perfect. Picture viewer. And let's keep that. And I wonder if I still, yeah, I still have the picture of the security duck. We're going to need that later in the game, too. Alright. So right now... Let's go on the medicine run. 
And if uh, you take too much time fighting Carlito, there's really not going to be enough time for you to complete this mission because it's kind of short. So, let's use the quick step, and why don't I keep doing that? And later, Otis is gonna call about a bunch of survivors in a little bit.